What's going on everybody? Fernando here from Georgian BMW. Today on the channel, we're gonna be unveiling something we've been waiting for a long time. It's the 2021 BMW X3 30e. Before we get started here, if you're new to the channel, please take a moment to click that subscribe button down at the bottom to show your support and keep up with us and all things BMW. As you probably guessed it, the E is for the plug-in variant of this car. Now this X3 is completely the same as any other X3 that you could possibly purchase. The only determining factor from the outside is the charging door. Other than that, this car looks identical to any other X3. Let's talk about the power specs for this X330e. So it still comes with the two liter turbo engine, made it to the electric engine. It's gonna pump out 288 horsepower and 310 pound foot of torque, giving this plenty of power to get up and go. Let's talk pure electric range for the X330e. On a pure electric charge, the car is gonna go approximately 30 kilometers. After that, it's gonna switch over into the combustion or hybrid mode, where it will use the combustion engine to get going and regenerative braking in order to start to recharge itself, giving you plenty of distance that you can go for your commute and never giving you that anxiety feeling of, do I have enough charge or do I have enough range to get to where I need to go? This is a great option when it comes to people who are gonna do longer drives or shorter drives without having to worry. So charging behaviors for the X3e are gonna be no different than your cell phone. When you get home at night, before you go to bed, you always plug this guy in because you would never wanna not have a full charge for the next day. So the X3 is gonna be just the same thing. Get home, pull it into your driveway, and just plug it in. Easy as that, and then you're gonna have a full charge ready to go for the very next day. Another unique advantage to the X330e is you can actually use the BMW Connected Drive app to tell the car when to start charging. Reason why you'd want to do that is to start taking advantages of off-peak electricity hours. Now inside the X3, you're going to feel all of the premium offerings from BMW. From soft touch surfaces on the dash, on the doors, the really nice soft Vernasca leather, even all of the great tech offerings that you get and expect from BMW. Being a passenger in the X3 is definitely an easy thing to do. Let's put sizing into perspective. So this generation of the X3 is actually bigger both lengthwise and widthwise than the original X5, giving us plenty of headroom, plenty of legroom, and then of course all the luxury creature comforts. We have got dual zone climate control back here for myself and another passenger, rear heated seats, and USB-Cs to charge all of our devices while we're going on a road trip. You've even got cup holders. Now, most people go into SUVs because they need spaces for growing families, sports, anything like that. Now, storage is not an issue in this particular car. Plenty of cargo space back here, and if you do need more, folding the seats is as simple as pulling a button. Giving you as much space as you need. Now, the only difference with the X3e, due to the batteries, is you do lose a little bit of space, but it does give you an extra storage compartment just in here. That's gonna wrap up our review of the 2021 BMW X330e. If you haven't already, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down at the bottom to keep up with us and all things BMW. Until next time, thanks for watching.